In this question, they would like to find out what if 500 gram of water here will be transformed into at 20 Celsius transformed to 0 Celsius water and then change to ice and then change to negative 10 Celsius ice. Basically, this involves three stages of heat loss Q1, which is uh, water, hot water become cold water from 20 degrees Celsius to 0 degrees Celsius, and then a 0 degrees Celsius water transform into an ice cube at 0 Celsius as well. So this is a latent heat, specific latent heat. And uh, the ice itself will become a cooler ice by becoming a negative 10 degrees Celsius ice. So, uh, involving the heat loss of Q2. So, the, the total heat required or the, the total heat release is actually, uh, we can write this total heat release. We can write this as Q1 plus H1 plus Q2. Okay? So we could write this uh, total heat total as uh, we can factorize the m c theta. We can factorize the m actually. This is m c theta. What kind of theta is this? This is uh, twenty minus zero, and this is uh, water, and then uh, h is actually m l. So L of the fusion of uh, ice. Okay, so then the last one is a uh, M C theta. This what C is this? Ice. And what kind of theta is this? Uh, zero minus minus ten, so or negative ten, whatever changes, doesn't matter, negative or positive. So ten minus zero is just ten. So the mass is zero point five, you can factorize it because all of them having the same mass. And uh, Water is 4200 times 20, that's the first one. Okay, so you plus the M is already factorized, so you just take LF uh, 33600. Okay, then we plus the ice is 2100 and then times 10, so put another 10. So the calculation in the end will give us a value of 220.5 kilojoule okay so I'm gonna write it here 220.5 kilojoule okay press your calculator and find out the value